Hey y'all, uh, Saturday, uh, I believe it's May the 11th, uh, Fern Creek, Kentucky, and uh, we're going to do a little gardening today. Uh, Mama went up and bought some of these maters, and we got some peppers, and I don't have a clue what that is, but uh, she likes me, when she does her stuff in these planters, she likes me to drill holes in them uh, so, uh, you know, the water can feed off. This one actually has a little doodah in it, but... Uh, she likes having more holes in it. I guess it keeps the the uh, the roots from rotting or whatnot. But uh, reckon I'll uh, hook her up with some holes here. And then uh, I'll go over and get my post hole diggers out and we'll dig us some holes. drilled some holes in some of her uh, planters here and she likes using my old uh, leftover beer cans for what do you use those for mom keep the pot from too much. to keep the pot from weighing too much I guess you don't have to use as much soil uh, just a little tip from mom and I'm glad to help her out like that maybe I'll actually even uh, help her out a little more this afternoon <laughs> we got some big ones to fill up here <laughs> I think a 12 will do it well this looks more like an 18 pack <laughs> okay y'all here's another uh, 18 pack worth <laughs> okay we'll clean them up real good for her or get out last year's funk you know, it's Mother's Day tomorrow, guys. You need to get out there and do something with your mom today. Or at least tomorrow. All right, y'all, I got him one of those shepherd hook doodahs, too. And I think she's going to grow some uh, herbs in here. So... Well, like that or higher? Or... Okay. All right, y'all. Uh, let us get after this. Gonna have some herbery. What are you doing there, Mom? Lightweight potting soil with with Miller Light lightweight beer cans. She said I didn't drink enough beer the other day to to help her out. <laughs> we can fix that. See, she put her cans in there like that, and then I guess she'd like layer them if I had more, and it makes the the the, the pot itself a lot lighter than it would be full of uh, soil, and it doesn't hurt anything. Except for the vegetables have a, a hint of Miller Lite to them. <laughs> you want to get in the dirt? Come here, boy. Come here. Come up here. Yeah, that's a boy. That's daddy's boy right there. <laughs> Hunt him down, boy. Hunt him down. We got chipmunks bad. <laughs> you on him? There he goes. <laughs> the 
Sarge, where is he? Yeah, that one there looks a little weak. That one there looks a little weak. Uh oh. There you go. There you go, Al. We got some Canadian stuff going on here, buddy. Root Blast, Formula 212. Canadian style. You don't take them out of that plastic thing? Yeah. Oh, okay. Loosen the root ball up a little bit. What you need? Mm -hmm. That one there looks a little healthier. Oh, great. And it'll come back to life. Hey y'all, I don't know if y'all ever seen this before, but uh, um, I had this on the back of my uh, 76 GMC uh, pickup truck, and uh, I no longer have my truck, I've got my E350 now, but what I did was just took a pair of old speakers I had laying around and took some sheet metal, made some hitters, and uh, panned it off, and now I've got this sitting on here for it's, I think I've had this out here, what now, about six, seven years now, and uh, she stores all of her... Uh, gardening stuff in it you know makes it easy on so all right yeah let's uh, okay, transport this is my job mom's got the green thumb i got the back there we go okay i'll get you some bricks so we can elevate it so it'll drain Never have too many bricks. <laughs> One day I'm gonna brick all this in. So many projects. Get him, boy. Get him, boy. Oh, you're kidding me. <laughs> Don't even know my own strength there. Broke the hoe. Close enough. Any rocket science? Just made her. What's that, Mom? Oh, that's rosemary, and I think that's uh, oregano. Oregano? Alright, she's gonna put a couple stakes in there just to 
let them grow up to it and then when they get a little bigger she'll get some heavier duty ones to stick in there but uh, I think she's good to go on that now good and level ready to rock got the bunny rabbit I painted protecting it so ready to rock you gonna put them all in there Or tequila, tequila. It's lovely. What you like? Moss rose. Okay. All right. Probably love it around here though, but not on Sunday when I'm ready to do a project. It always rains. I got to get that stuff done up front. These flowers come, come out in the sunlight and then in the evening they close back up. Huh, okay. Sounds pretty cool. Or tequila. They sleep at night. Pretty hardy. All right, we got tequila sunrise and uh, some uh, oregano and some thyme. So uh, we're we'll gonna be rocking the spices this year. And I'm getting ready to plant some peppers for her here in just a minute, where she wants them. So okay, all right, I'm gonna plant mom some peppers here. Um, broke out the new cobalts, uh, fiberglass post hole diggers here. Uh, pretty neat, man. They got these uh, actually where you pop them, pop it together right here. It'll uh, eject the dirt out, or somewhat. But all right, six of them. All right. Okay, y'all, that's the style of hole she said she wanted. So she'll put her pot and soil or whatever that stuff is in there and, and her little miracle stuff. And then we'll plant them here in a minute. Like I said, I dig the holes. I don't have the green thumb. And we got maters to plant over there. So, all right, y'all. Let me get after it. We used to have a big magnolia tree here that shaded the whole deck and everything, but had one of those freaking bad storms, took it out. Beautiful tree. A lot bigger than that one right there. I think that tree actually right there came off of our tree seedling. pot and soil down in there.
All right, pepper number one. Pepper number two. I just realized that we're using Juanita's uh, uh, candy. Ray sent me. Or we're using Juanita's uh, candy kitchen thing that Ray sent me. Yeah. Not only tooth decay, but uh, pepper planting. Now I appreciate it, Ray. Tell old, old man Ray I said thanks. Okay, plant pepper three. Watch him. Watch him, fella. All right, plant number four. Peppa, Peppa. Juanita's kitchen. What you gonna do with that other pepper? I know I'll pot it up or something. You don't want me to put put it there? Huh? I can dig you another hole right there. I was hitting rocks with that blue one. So what I'm gonna do is pull out my dad's old trusty U.S. Army uh, bob wire cutter. Go right through it. Boom. 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 All right, y'all. Should be in business now. There we go. Okay, y'all. We're going to work our way around with this. Oh yeah, that's heavy gauge, baby. Oh. 
Now we're talking. Now that look. Right now we're talking guys. Let's do this one. <sighs> These are thick. <laughs> yeah, it was good. I'm gonna put the blue in over now. Gotta get color coordinated. Take a little more off on. Ain't gonna whoop me. Okay. All right, y'all. <laughs> Don't look too bad. Enjoying this. Yeah. Backyard fun with the family. Basically, this whole bed's that stuff, ain't it? That planting mix. How deep you want this one? I'm digging this feature. <laughs>
like yeah, it ought to be pretty rich. Heck, we may have enough to do another box. Just one spoon. Okay, y'all, she's got the bottom of her pot taken off. We got some new uh, potting soil in there. And now she's gonna uh, plant it. You gotta rip off that top piece too. I guess it's for drainage or something. But uh, these are better bush uh, hybrid tomatoes. <laughs> are you having fun over there, boy? But, uh, and she also got some heirlooms too. So we're going to plant, plant those in uh, pots. Okay. Okay, y'all, it uh, started to get a little drizzle here. Um, we pretty much got everything wrapped up. I was just going to take you around mom's little garden in here. Um, of course those are knockout roses um not really sure what what the true names of this stuff is but i know it looks good she does a great job on it and she really loves what she does so but anyway we got uh i got the holes dug for for her peppers and we got uh got the pot and soil in there and that good fertilizer stuff she loves that comes from canada got her little uh uh uh, cages on here decorative cages with the other style cages um, Actually got her heirloom tomato planted here and got our box good and level are pretty close to level guys. Let's see Yep, that's pretty much dead on uh, She's got some fake tulips here. Uh, I believe this is called lamb's ear. Sarge likes chewing on it um, She's actually got some peppers growing in this pot with, along with some I think she said those things are like fake pansies um, little bumblebees, little artwork stuff. Um, right here in this uh, uh, shepherd's hook doodah thing we got here, I believe she's got some uh, basil, no not basil, thyme and oregano planted in this one. And I think she called this thing a moss rose. It's tequila sunrise or something. Uh, pretty neat looking. Um, of course she's got, I don't know what these are called, they're nice looking I guess, daffodils or something. Um, and then she's got strategically placed all her little, you know, fake, uh, <laughs> fake flowers. Um, we got our maters planted over here. Uh, let's see. We dug those out pretty good. These are better bush tomatoes. And uh, they'll grow up this pole here. And once they start getting long, we'll, we'll, uh, I put these posts in a long time ago. And uh, we'll just strap them to these posts and, you know, let it wrap around the cage or or whatnot so hopefully we get a good yield this year um, we always do she grows peppers like wildfire um, I love bell peppers and sausage and just about bell peppers with everything I love it um, but anyway guys uh, just wanted to get out here and kind of work with my mom today you know tomorrow's Mother's Day and I know she really enjoys this and uh, just wanted to spend some time with her um, I suggest everybody does so just wanted to wish uh, my friends and my subscribers, their mothers and their wives and everybody a, a happy Mother's Day, y'all. All right, y'all. Take care. Thanks for watching my videos.